They have a have a block close by, have a roll, and have a strap. We'll be working into uh, hips, hip opening poses today. So we'll get started. So sit in a way that feels comfortable for you to sit. Align the back of your skull with your tailbone. Let your arms rest onto your thighs and, and feel for lifting belly, down from lip chest. Close your eyes. And feel for celebrating stepping onto your mat. Giving yourself this time, this moment, uh, just for you. Notice the energy that is moving through your body uh, right now. And stay, stay with the sensation, stay with the physical sensation that comes up for you. Today, keep the focus on taking in what feels like the right amount for you, the right dosage. So in any of the poses, don't feel that you have to push so deep so that you're experiencing pain. So don't set your expectation of, oh, I know that I'm getting it right because I'm really hurting in this pose. You know, have a different mindset in relation to the pose. Try to increase your awareness and sensitivity to yourself and move to the poses, move into the poses in such a way that allows you to feel the pose, but in such a way that you're not hurting in the pose. Inhale, expand ribs. Exhale, relax your jaw. Deep breath, expand your ribs. Exhale, relax your shoulders down. Grounding down into your sit bones and breathe in, telescope the ribs, so lift your belly, diaphragm, lift chest. And exhale, feel for that release. On your next breath, breathe in and feel for taking in what feels like the right amount for you. And exhale. And release. Still wrist stretches. So reach your left hand forward, turn the palm of the hands away from you, and then reach the fingers back towards your wrist. Feel that opening from the top of the wrist to the back of the wrist. Take hold of your little finger. Deep breath. Inhale, lift your, lift your diaphragm, lift chest. Exhale, spread the fingers. Feel the spread through the palm of hands. Taking hold of your ring finger. As you breathe in, lift your rib cage up. Exhale. Soften shoulders down. Feel the spread of the fingers. Take it hold of your middle finger. As you breathe in, feel for spreading ribs. Exhale, lengthen each finger away from the other. Take it hold of your index finger. Inhale, glide your thumb 
away from your index finger. Exhale, open the palm of your hands forward. Back of your hands together, you're taking hold of your thumb. And inhale, glide your thumb away from your index finger. Exhale, heel of the hand is forward. Release, change hands. Taking hold of the little finger on your right hand, glide it down, glide it back. Deep breath, spread ribs. Exhale, soften your shoulder away from your ear. Taking hold of your middle finger. Inhale, lift your, lift your belly, diaphragm, lift chest. Exhale, feel the stretch through the palm of your hand. Taking hold of your middle finger. Breathe in external. So chest lifts as if you're lifting out and up. Belly's away from pelvis. And exhale, glide your middle finger back. Taking hold of your first finger. Breathe in, glide your thumb away from your index finger. And exhale, open the heel of your hands forward. Back of your hands together, you're taking hold of your uh, right thumb. As you breathe, glide your thumb away from your index finger. And exhale, lengthen each finger to the floor. Release, change the cross of your legs. Wrist stretching stage two. So you're reaching your hands forward, palm of the hand spaces away from you. You're on your fingertips. Your hands are lined with shoulders. Bend elbows slightly and then breathe in. Lengthen out of lower back. Exhale. Press the heel of the hands. Press the heel of the hands forward, but bend the elbows. Breathe in. Lift belly away from pelvis. Exhale. Open your hands forward. Soften the shoulders away from your ears. Inhale, peel your hands up and then reach your arms out to the side for wrist stretches, stage three. Middle finger is reaching straight up, longest finger straight up. Inhale to the palm of hands. Hold the breath, make a fist, bringing in your little finger, ring finger, middle finger, first finger, squeeze the thumb on top. Exhale, you're stretching the knuckles to the floor. Release, open your hands, thumbs pointing skywards. Palm of the hand space is me, breathe in. Hold the breath, bring it in your thumb. Simultaneously, all fingers squeezes onto the thumb. Exhale, you should stretch your thumb side away from you. Release, reach your arms out. Middle fingers pointing straight up. Breathe to the palm of hands. Hold the breath. Now bringing in your little finger, ring finger, middle finger, first finger, thumb squeezes on top, squeeze all the air out, exhale, knuckles to the floor. Release, open your hands, thumbs pointing skywards, breathe to the palm of hands. Hold the breath, now bring in your thumbs, simultaneously squeeze all fingers to the thumb and exhale, stretch your thumb side away from you. Release, let your arms relax down by your side. Pranayama today is alternate nostril breathing in shoelace pose. So bring your left foot on top of your right thigh, just above your knee. Flex the toes back towards your shins, reach your heels away from you. That's a difficult reach. Your left foot is onto your right calf, or your foot is onto the floor, or stay in cross leg. Seated. Hold the first two fingers down of your right hand. Use your thumb to block your right nostril. Inhale through your left nostril for five. Block both nostrils, hold the breath, hold for 20. So feet is active, spine is long. Keep feeling. That sensation of lengthening out of lower back. Exhale through right nostril for 10. Breathe through 
through your right nostril for five. Got both nostrils, hold the breath, you're holding for 20. Exhale, left nostril, exhale for 10. And release, change the cross to the nose. Pull the first two fingers down of your uh, left hand. Use your ring finger to block your right nostril. Breathe through your left nostril for five. Got both nostrils, hold the breath, hold for 20. Exhale, right nostril for 10. Breathe through your right nostril for five. Got both nostrils, hold, hold for 20. Exhale left for 10. And release. Bring the soles of your feet together. Your toes are flexed back towards your shins. Your heels about 12 inches away from your uh, pelvic bone. Your next pose today is hip opening. So bring both hands onto your left thigh. Press down into right sit bone, breathe in. Ease your left sit bone away from floor and then traction, exhale, traction your left thigh away from hip. Bring your right hand to the floor by your right hip. Breathe in, lift your side ribs away from left hip. Exhale, slide your left thigh away from hip. Breathe in, lift belly away from pelvis. Exhale, feel the easing your left thigh towards the left. Breathe to lower back, lengthening out of lower back. And as you breathe, feel as if you're gliding your left thigh away from left hip. Inhale, lift your belly, diaphragm, lift chest. And as you exhale, you're folding towards the right, your left thigh moves to left. Inhale, expand your ribs. Exhale, straighten your uh, left arm and then fold as if you're folding towards your right thigh. Inhale, sit bones presses down, you're lengthening out of lower back. And exhale, fold. Coming into third stage, bring both hands down either side of your right thigh and knee. Press your left sit bone to floor, breathe in and lengthen out of left side. Exhale, fold towards your right thigh, left sit bone back to the floor. Breathe in and lengthen belly away from pelvis. Exhale, send your left thigh towards the right, forehead towards the left. Feel this right from your pelvic bone and breathe in as you lift your belly away from pelvis. Exhale, fold. Inhale, release. You're pushing the floor away. Breathe in to come all the way up. Bring both hands to one of your right hand is on top of your right thigh, left hand is on the knee. Press into the left sit bone. Breathe in. Ease your right sit bone away from the floor. And as you exhale, send your right thigh towards the right. 
and your left hand by left hip. As you inhale, lengthen out of your lower back. Exhale, glide your right thigh away from right hip. Breathe in, lift that hip. And exhale, extending the right thigh to right. Deep breath, expand your ribs. And exhale, your traction, your right thigh to right. Breathe to heart. Feel this right through sternum as you move your chest to chin. Exhale, slightly twist to the left. Breathe in, lengthen lower ribs away from sacrum. And exhale, you're twisting towards the left as your right thigh lengthens to right. Inhale, lift your side ribs away from your left hip. Exhale, glide your right thigh towards the right. Third position, bring your hands down so the hands are either side of your left thigh. And then breathe in, stretch out of lower back. Exhale, fold over your left thigh, left right sit bone back to foot. Breathe in, lengthen, belly away from pelvis. And exhale, fold, belly pulls in. Feel the energy that's moving through you now. So feel this, your sit bones are down and lengthening out of lower back. Exhale, fold. Inhale, release. Then ease all the way on back up. From here, straighten your uh, right leg. So you're reaching your right leg straight forward. Your left foot is flat to the floor. Your uh, the right leg is reaching forward. Left foot is flat to the floor. Right arm is reaching around. It's hugging the thigh towards the chest. Left hand is lined up behind you. Breathe in and stretch out of lower back. Exhale, reach your right foot forward, twist to the left. Deep, deep breath, lift belly away from pelvis. Exhale, twist towards the left, actively send your right leg forward. Inhale, expand ribs. And exhale, twist. Inhale, release. Place your left foot on the inside of your right thigh. Draw your right left heel towards the groin. Pressing down into sit bone, breathe in, reaching your arms out and up. Exhale, folding forward. You might be able to take hold of the foot, the ankle, the calf. Breathe to lower back and stretch out of lower back. Exhale, fold. Keep the back of the neck relaxed. Inhale, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Exhale, fold. One more like this, deep breath. And fold on exhale. Inhale, release, pushing the floor away, breathe in as you come all the way up. Straighten your left leg. Reach out, spread the toes. Your right foot is your right foot is flat to the floor. Bring your left arm around and you're hugging your right thigh towards the chest. Right arm lines up with sit, sit bone and reach it back. Press down into your right foot. Breathe in left, lift out to right side. And exhale, twist towards the right. Send your left leg forward. Breathe in and lengthen, lengthen out of lower back. Exhale, twist to the right. Inhale, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Feel your diaphragm as it lifts up. Now exhale, as you twist towards the right, you're reaching your left foot forward. One more like this, breathe in, expand your ribs. 
and exhale, twist. Inhale, release. Tuck your uh, right foot in, so the right heel moves towards the groin. Your right foot presses against your left hand. Reach your left foot forward. Sit the bones pressing down, breathing, and reaching your arms out and up. And exhale, you're folding forward. You might be able to take hold of the ball of your foot, the hands to the floor, ankle, or hands to the floor. Breathe to lower back and lengthen out of lower back. Exhale, fold, pull belly in. Inhale, expand your ribs wide out towards your armpits. Lead with your chest. Exhale as you fold. Breathe in, lift belly away from your left thigh. And exhale, allow your body to melt forward. Feel your sit bones as it presses back to floor. And then breathe in, you're lengthening out of lower back. And exhale, fold. Inhale, release, push the floor away, breathe in as you come all the way up. Coming into your abdominal sequence, starting with elbow to knee. Have a roll uh, in close, close by. So lie down onto your backs. That's your hands behind your head. And pick your feet up off the floor so your knees are bent. If your back is tweaky, you can't do the pose with the soles of your feet down to the floor. Feet up, knees are bent. Heels are just below the knees and toes and flex the shin. Elbow to knee. Inhale, lift your head and shoulder blades up away from the floor, hold the breath. Press your lower back down, curl tailbone up. Exhale, both elbows to left knee and reach your right leg forward. Your right heel is about one meter away from the floor, full belly down. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back down, curl tailbone up. Exhale, both elbows to right knee and reach your left foot forward. Your left foot is reaching out about 45 degrees angle. Send your left leg forward. Reach your elbows up. Pull belly down. Inhale. Head to center. Bend the knees. Hold the breath. Press your lower back down. Curl tailbone up. Exhale. Elbows to left knee and reach your right leg forward. Relax your right hip. Bend your right thigh forward. Pull belly down. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath, press your lower back down, curl tailbone up, exhale, both elbows to right knee and reach your left leg forward. Relax your left hip, lengthen your left thigh forward and away from hip, pull belly down. Inhale, come back to center, exhale, lower your head and shoulders down towards the floor and place your feet down. So in this next sequence, the next two poses, I'm going to go really slow. I want you to sort of feel every pose, every cue that I give, I really want you to feel that movement. So if I'm demonstrating that pose, hands are behind head and neck. When you inhale, you're lifting up and then reach your elbows up. You'll feel your side muscles are opening. Exhale. So inhale, lift head and shoulder blades up, you pause. You press your lower back down, curl tailbone up. Exhale, elbows to left knee. You're reaching your right leg forward. Feel for moving your right thigh bone away from hip bone, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back down, curl tailbone up. Exhale, elbows to right knee and reach the left leg forward. Now reach your thigh bone away from hip bone, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center. Exhale, lower head and shoulders down. Okay, so that's really where I want you to go today. And we'll do that, we'll do that together. So we'll do this three more on each side. 
Okay, so lie down. Hands clasped behind head and neck. Feet are off the floor, the knees are bent, knees are lined with hips. Going together, press your lower back to floor. Inhale, lift your head and shoulder blades up. Hold the breath. Press your lower back down and curl tailbone up. Exhale, reach both elbows to left knee and reach your right leg to Relax your right thigh, extend your right leg forward, reach your elbows up, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back down, curl tailbones up. Exhale, both elbows to right knee and reach your left leg forward. Relax your left hip, lengthen your left thigh forward. Reach your elbows up, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back down, curl to elbows up. Exhale, both elbows to left knee, straighten right leg. So reach your right leg forward, spread the toes. Keep moving thigh bone away from hip bone, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath, press your lower back to floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up, both elbows to right knee and straight to left leg. So send your left leg forward, spread the toes. Keep moving your heel away from the floor about a meter. Pull belly down. Inhale, head to center. Bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back down and curl tailbone up. Good. Exhale, elbows to left knee, straighten uh, right leg. So keep sending your right leg forward, spread the toes, spread the ball of your foot. Good, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back to floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up, both elbows to right knee and straighten left leg. So relax your left hip and then send your left thigh forward away from waist, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center. Bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back down. Curl tailbone up. Exhale, elbows to left knee, straight to right leg. So reach your right leg forward, spread the toes. Feel for moving your right thigh away from hip. Pull belly down. Good, inhale, head to center. Bend the knees, hold the breath. Press your lower back down. Curl tailbone up. Good, exhale, elbows to right knee and send your left leg straight forward. Reach forward, spread the toes, relax your left hip, reach your left thigh forward, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees, hold the breath, press your lower back to floor. And exhale, release, lower head and shoulders down and place the soles of your feet to the floor. Good, well done. Notice how your body feels going a little deeper into this pose. Grab hold of your roll, place the roll between your thighs and reach your legs straight out and up, twisting out. Grab your hands behind your head and neck. If your back is creaky, you can bend the knees. You can also move to the wall so that the heels are up against the wall. Sit bones are about six inches away from the wall. Inhale, lift your head and shoulder blades up, away from the floor. Hold the breath. Squeeze the roll. Reach your legs straight up. Exhale, curl tailbone up, both elbows to left knee. Now squeeze the roll. Bend your legs straight up. Pull belly down. Inhale, bring your head to center. Hold the breath. Press your lower back down. Squeeze the roll. Exhale, curl tailbone up, reach your legs straight up, both elbows to right knee. Squeeze the roll, stretching your legs right up to the sky, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center, hold the breath. Press your lower back down, but keep head and shoulder blades up. Squeeze the roll. Exhale, curl tailbone up, reach your legs straight up, both elbows to left knee. Reach your left elbow up, the shoulder blades are off the floor. Send your leg straight up, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center, bend the knees. Don't bend the knees, just hold the breath. Squeeze the roll. 
Exhale, curl the elbows up, reach your legs straight up, both elbows to right. Squeeze the roll, lengthen your legs to the ceiling, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center, hold the breath. Press your lower back down, squeeze the roll. Exhale, curl the elbows up, reach your legs straight up, both elbows to left. Squeeze the roll. Now squeeze sit bone to tailbone. Lengthen your legs up. Reach your elbows up. Pull belly down. Inhale, head to center. Bend the knee. Don't bend the knees, just hold the breath and press your lower back down. Squeeze the roll. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Reach your legs straight up. Both elbows to right knee. Reach your right elbow up the shoulder blades away from the floor. Squeeze roll, squeeze sit bone to tailbone. Send your legs straight up, pull belly down. Inhale, head to center. Exhale, release. Go ahead and shoulders down, bend the knees and place the soles of your feet to the floor. Keep the roll between your thighs for bridge, bridge with the roll. So reach down with your fingertips, brush your heels with your fingertips. Move your heels back to sit bones or align them with your hips. Let your arms relax by your side and the shoulders away from your knees. Exhale, tuck tailbone. Inhale, spread the ribs, spread the diaphragm, chest moves to chin. Exhale, tilt pelvis, lift pelvis up away from the floor. Inhale, expand the ribs, spread your diaphragm as you move chest to chin. Exhale, tuck tailbone and lift up, squeeze the roll. Inhale, lengthen lower ribs away from sacrum. Exhale, tilt pelvis, lift up, push the floor away using your very strong legs. Inhale, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Exhale, tilt pelvis and lift up. Feel for pushing the floor away as you lift. Inhale, spread your ribs. Feel your ribs as they open wide to armpit. And exhale, lift up, pushing the floor away. Tailbone tucks as you lift. Relax your throat, relax your neck and jaw. Last one in this deep breath. Lengthen out of lower back. Exhale, tilt pelvis, lower your upper back to floor. Tilt pelvis, lower mid back to floor. And tilt pelvis, lower all the way on down to the floor. Keep it tilt until down. Move the roll out of your way. Twisted root, cross your left leg over your right. If you can, cross your left ankle on the right palm. Pass your hands behind your head and neck. If your back is tweaky, you can do this pose with your right foot onto the floor or your right foot pressing against the wall. Coming straight into the pose. Inhale, lift your head and shoulder blades up, away from the floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Now reach your thighs and knees straight up. Squeeze your inner thighs. Squeeze sit bone to tailbone. Pull belly down. Activate your feet. Release pelvis. Breathe into low back, spreading low ribs to floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Now send thighs and knees straight up. Squeeze thighs. Squeeze sit bone to tailbone. Pull belly in. Feet are active, spread the toes. Release pelvis. Breathe into low back, spreading low ribs to floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Now send thighs and knees straight up. Squeeze thighs, squeeze sit bones to tailbone. Pull belly in, reach your elbows up. Inhale, lower your head and shoulders to floor. Release your hands, clasp your hands on the midpoint of your left thigh. Keep head and shoulders to floor. Everyone, breathe into lower back, spreading lower ribs to floor. Exhale, tuck tailbone 
and press hands against the thighs. Press thighs against the hands. Squeeze thighs, squeeze sit bone, pull belly down. Release pelvis, breathe into lower back, spreading ribs. Exhale, curl tailbone up and press hands against the thighs. Press thighs against hands, squeeze thighs. Squeeze sit bone to tailbone, pull belly down. Release pelvis, breathe to lower back, spread ribs. Exhale, curl tailbone up, press hands against thighs, press. Thighs against hands, squeeze thighs, squeeze sit bone to tailbone, pull belly down. Inhale, release. Change the cross of your legs. Right is over left. If you can make the second cross go there and clasp hands behind head and neck. Again, your foot can be on the floor, left foot on the floor or a wall. Inhale, lift head, shoulder blades up. Now lift up, reach your elbows up, hold the breath. Exhale, curl tailbone up, send thighs and knees straight up. Squeeze thighs, squeeze sit bones to tailbone, pull belly down. Release pelvis, breathe into lower back, spread ribs. Exhale, curl tailbone up and send thighs and knees straight up. Squeeze inner thighs, squeeze sit bones to tailbone, be active. Pull belly down. Release pelvis. Breathe to low back, spreading ribs. Exhale, curl tailbone up. Stem thighs and knees straight up. Now squeeze thighs, squeeze. Sit bones to tailbone. Activate your feet. Pull belly down. Inhale, release. Lower your head and shoulders to floor. Release the hands. Clasp your hands on the midpoint of your right thigh. Second stage, again, you can have the foot onto the floor or a wall. That would be your left foot. Everyone, breathe to lower back, spread lower ribs to the floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up, press hands against thighs, press thighs against hands, squeeze thighs, squeeze, sit bone, pull lower belly down, be active, belly pulls in. Release pelvis, breathe into lower back, spreading the lower ribs to the floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up and press hands against the thighs. Press your thighs against hands, squeeze thighs. Squeeze sit bone to tailbone, pull belly down. Release pelvis, breathe to lower back, spreading ribs to the floor. Exhale, curl tailbone up and press hands against thighs. Press thighs against hands, squeeze thighs, squeeze sit bone, pull belly down. Inhale, release. Unwind the cross of your legs. Roll to your uh, right side. Bring your left hand to the floor by chest, breathe in. On exhale, push the floor away with your left hand as you come up. Right hand supports your head and neck. Come on to your uh, knees coming into dolphin pose. So dolphin today, we're doing dolphin and dolphin uh, strut. So I'll show you the I'll show you the pose, then we'll do that together. In your dolphin, you're measuring up your hands onto your biceps, your elbows into the floor. You will step your knees back slightly, knees are onto the hips, and reach your hands forward. Your hands are parallel, elbows aligned with shoulders. So watch. In this pose, you inhale, you lift your spread the back and curl toes under. Exhale, lift the knees off the floor and reach back. Then wrap the shoulders, feel the broadening across your back. So you're staying here for up to five breaths. You're going further. Left heel is aligned with sit bone. I've stepped my right foot in about three, maybe four inches. Right hand three reaches back, taking hold of heel, ankle, calf, or higher up. You stay here and breathe, deep breath. Exhale, reach your right heel to floor. If you can go further, you're reaching your left leg 
out and up. Foot comes down, hands goes back down and do the same. Either come down, get up and do the same the other side or stay up and do the same the other side. So that's where we're going with feet. So measure our hands off the biceps. Elbows to the floor. Reach your hands forward. Now parallel your forearms or clasp your hands. Relax your neck and shoulders. Everyone breathe into upper back, lift and spread upper back, curl toes under. Exhale, lift your knees off the floor and then lengthen spine. If your back is tweak or if your knees or hamstrings are tight, bend the knees. Deep breath, spread your ribs, spread your upper back. Exhale, push the floor away with your forearms and reach your sit bones back. Keep the neck relaxed, keep looking at your own toes. Breathe in, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Exhale, lengthen, reach your sit bones back, feel the lengthening through spine. Inhale, spread your side ribs. Exhale, feel as if you're squeezing the outer side of your side ribs. Your muscles are tucking towards your uh, armpits. One more like this, breathe into lower back, lengthen lower ribs away from sacrum. Exhale, reach your sit bones back. You're going further, uh, strut. Step your left, step your right foot forward about a couple of inches. Left heels aligned with left sit bone. Reach your right hand back, wrap hold of heel, ankle, calf, or higher up. Deep breath, inhale, breathe to right hip. Exhale, reach your right heel to floor. Inhale, spread your ribs. Exhale, wrap your left shoulder as you reach your left sit bone back. Both heels are reaching to floor. You're going further in terms of one leg up. Press your right foot to floor, breathe in. Lift your left leg up. And exhale, reach it back. Breathe to left hip, feel for sending left thigh away from pelvis. And exhale, lengthen your left leg back. Reach back, spread the toes. Deep breath, inhale. And exhale, lengthen your left leg away from you. Deep inhale. Exhale, lower your left foot to the floor. And then change for the other side. Either come down and change. Or from here, step your left foot forward, line up your right heel with your right sit bone. Reach the left hand back, grab hold of the ankle, grab hold of the heel, the ankle, the calf. And breathe to left hip. Exhale, reach your left heel to floor. Keep the neck relaxed. Breathe in, expand ribs. Exhale, push the floor away with your right forearm. Left the left heel to floor. Left heel, left foot presses to floor. You're working deeper. Breathe in, lift your right leg up. And exhale, reach it back. Deep breath, expand ribs. And exhale, send in your right leg back. Spread the toes. On the breath, feel the moving belly away from the top of your left thigh. And as you exhale, Lengthening your right leg back. Deep breath, inhale, send your right thigh away from right hip. Exhale, lower your right foot to floor. Place your left hand down. Inhale. Exhale, release. Bend the knees. Come all the way on down. Come on to the knees for bird wing. So either Standing up onto, onto knees or sitting onto heels. Elbows are tucked in. From here, breathe in and reach your arms forward. Exhale, open your arms out towards the side, feel the shoulder blade squeezing. Breathe in as you're reaching four arms forward. Exhale and open out. Squeeze shoulder blades, slide the shoulders down. Breathe in, you're lengthen forward. And exhale, feel this opening. One more like this, breathe in. And exhale as you open out to the side. 
and release. When your hands to the floor, from here you're coming straight up to stand. You stand at the front of your mat. Standing into Dasna, so your hands are reaching straight down, spread the fingers. Your heels are lined up with your uh, sit bones. If your back is tweaky, bring your feet a little bit wider about hip distance apart. Uh, you, if you're moving into this pose, then your knees are tweaky. Again, coming into salutation. So again, you can pat your knees, which is where I'm going. And then you're standing, ready to move into your poses. Exhale, hands together by your chest. Press your feet to floor, breathe in and reach your arms out and up. Lift your chest, reach your arms back, opening shoulders. Exhale, fold forward, that is in tailbone tucks. Lunge, inhale, step your left leg back. Bend the left knee, place your knee to the floor, pad your knee if needed. Then hands on the floor, on your thigh, or you're reaching your arms out and up to sky. Exhale, hands down, step back for plank. Reach for the heels, bend the knees, exhale, lower down, keep the elbows tucked in. Cobra, low cobra. Bring your hands forward so the elbows are under the shoulders. Lengthen your legs back, tuck elbows. Breathe in, move your chest and ribs forward. Now draw your chest forward whilst lengthening the left back. If you can, elbows are off the floor by about three inches. Exhale, draw your chest forward as you come down. Readjust hands under the shoulders. Breathe to lower back, curl toes under. Exhale, press back, down the face again. Warrior, inhale, step your left foot forward for lunge. Place your right knee to the floor. Push the floor away, reaching your arms out and up to sky. Exhale, hands down, step your right leg forward, forward bend. Breathe in, stand up, pushing the floor away as you reach your arms out and up to the sky. Exhale, hands together, back chest. Feet presses down, breathe in, arms up, telescoping ribs. Exhale, fold forward, bellies in, tailbone top. Lunge, breathe in, step your right leg back, bend your right knee, and push the floor away, reaching your arms out and up to stand. Exhale, hands down, step back for plank. Reach for the heels. Either bend the knees and come down, or lower down, keep the elbows tucked in. Cobra or low cobra. Breathe in and move your chest, ribs forward, lengthen legs back. Exhale, release, lower down, hands under the shoulders, press it back down with them. Lunge, breathe in, step your right leg forward between the hands. Left knees to the floor, push go away and reach your arms out and up to the sky. Exhale, hands down, step your left foot forward, forward bend. Breathe in, stand up. Lift your chest, reach your arms to the sky. Exhale, hands together, by chest. Here, pose, bend the knees. Breathe in, sweep your arms out and up. Reach your sit bones back. Exhale, fold, belly in. Breathe in, scoop chest away from thighs and knees. Flatten your hands and as you breathe that step, or hop it back to plank. Modify chaturanga, knees are bent, lower down or lower straight down. Cobra, inhale. Move your chest and ribs forward, lengthen legs back. Exhale, press back down with dog. Warrior one, breathe in, step your left foot forward by left hand, right foot towards the right edge of the mat. Hands on the floor, on your thigh, or you're reaching your arms out and up to the sky. Exhale, hands down, step back for plank. Reach your heels, exhale, lower down. Push the floor away as you lower down. Inhale, cobra, chest forward, legs lengthen back. Exhale, press back down with dog, wrap the shoulders. Warrior one, breathe in, step your right foot forward by right hand, left foot towards the left edge of the mat. Push the door away and reach your arms out and up to sky. Exhale, hands down, step back for plank. Reach for the heels, exhale, lower down. Cobra or low cobra, inhale. Move chest, bridge forward, lengthen legs back. Exhale, press back down with dog. On the breath, breathe in, bend the knees, Step or hop your legs between the hands. Exhale, fold forward, bellies in. Inhale, stand up. Reach your arms out and up. Exhale, sit into chair pose. Reach your sit bones back. Inhale, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Exhale, fold, bellies in. Breathe in, scoop chest away from thighs and knees. Exhale, step 
or hug it back to plank. Lower down halfway and then breathe into upward facing dog. So push the floor away. Move your chest forward. Lengthen your legs back. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Push the floor away in downward dog. Wrap the shoulders. Warrior one, breathe in. Step your left foot forward by left hand. Right foot towards the right edge of the mat. Push the floor away. Reach your arms out and up to the sky. Exhale, hands down. Step back to plank. Reach for the heels. Exhale, lower down halfway. And then breathe into upward facing dog. Move your chest forward. Lengthen your legs back. Exhale, press back down with facing dog. Warrior one, breathe in, step your left edge of the mat. Push your away and reach your arms straight out and up. Exhale, hands down, step back to plank. Reach for the heels. Exhale, lower halfway, and then breathe to upward dog. Move chest forward, lengthen your legs back. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. On the breath, breathe in, bend the knees. Step or hop your legs between the hands. Exhale, hold, bellies in. Inhale, stand up. Exhale, hands together, back to. Standing up the front of your mat, coming into a three pose vignette. So knees are bent, chair pose, breathe in, sweep your arms up, lift your chest. Reach your sit bones back. Exhale, fold, bellies in. Breathe in, move chest forward away from thighs and knees. Exhale, step or hop it back to plank. Lower down, keep elbows in. Inhale, cobra or upward dog. Exhale, press it back, downward facing dog. Warrior two, breathe in, step your left foot forward between the hands. Your left heel is aligned with the arc of your right foot. Feet about three and a half feet away from each other. Let your arms relax by your side, shoulders away from your ears. Inhale into upper back. Hold the breath, shoulders up. Hold your breath, shoulders back. Exhale, squeeze, top tips of shoulders, squeeze. Draw down. Inhale, spread. Exhale, squeeze the mid tips of shoulders and squeeze, draw down. Inhale, spread. Exhale, squeeze the low tips, bend the elbows and squeeze, squeeze, draw down. Inhale, spread. Hold the breath, shoulders up. Hold your breath, shoulders back. Exhale, squeeze, top tips of shoulders, squeeze, draw down. Inhale, spread. Exhale, squeeze, mid tips of shoulders, squeeze, continue to squeeze, glide, shoulders down. Inhale, spread. Exhale, squeeze, low tips, elbows bent, and squeeze, 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 draw down. Release, put your arms out to the side, warrior two. Standing warrior variation, place your left forearm onto your left thigh, slide your right arm around the back, tucking it onto the thigh by hip. Press your left foot to floor, and then breathe, lift your side ribs away from left hip. Exhale, slide your right shoulder, glide it down and away from your ear. Breathe in and move belly away from pelvis. Exhale, send your left hip back. Left sit bone reaches to right heel. As you breathe, lift sternum and move chest to chin. Exhale, relax your jaw. Inhale, release, pigeon. Bring your hands down either side of your left foot. Is your left foot to the right edge of the mat. Straighten your right leg, so you're reaching your right leg back. If you can, stay onto the ball of your right foot so the right knee is off the floor. Hands are under the shoulders. Breathe in, lengthen belly away from pelvis. And exhale, fold. If that's a difficult reach, your knee can come down to the floor, release the back foot. If that's a difficult reach into knees or hips, then sit onto left sit bone and fold diagonally over your left shin. And breathe deeply, keep lengthening out of lower back. Exhale, reach back. You're reaching your right leg away from you. Deep breath, lengthen belly away from pelvis. 
and exhale forward, bellies in. Relax your neck and shoulders as much as you're able, and then breathe, expand your ribs. And exhale, fold. Inhale, release. Walk your hands back so the hands are under the shoulders. Go the toes under of your right foot. Step your left leg back for plank. Feet together, feel as if you're pushing the floor away. Hands are under the shoulders. Exhale, lower down. Push the floor away as you lower down. Inhale, cobra or upward facing dog. So move your chest and ribs forward. Lengthen your legs back. Don't touch the heels. And now press back, downward facing dog. Now wrap the shoulders in downward dog. Set your feet in a couple of inches and reach your heels to the floor. Warrior two, inhale, step your right foot forward between the hands. Left foot is straight to the short edge of the mat. Right heel is aligned with the arc of the back foot. Arms are reaching out to the side. Then relax your arms down by your side. So we Take a deep breath into upper back. Hold the breath, shoulders up. Hold the breath, shoulders back. Exhale, squeeze top tips of shoulders. Squeeze, draw down. Inhale, spread. Exhale, squeeze. Mid tips of shoulders, squeeze. Now squeeze as you draw down. Inhale, spread. Exhale, squeeze. Low tips of shoulders, squeeze, draw down. Inhale, spread. Hold the breath, shoulders up. Hold breath, shoulders back. Exhale, squeeze the top tips of shoulders. Draw down. Inhale, spread. Exhale, squeeze the mid tips of shoulders. Draw down. Inhale, spread. Exhale, squeeze. Bend the elbows and squeeze the low tips of shoulders. Draw down. Release. Extended warrior variation. Place your right forearm onto your right thigh. Bring your left arm around and tuck it onto your thigh by your hip. Relax your right ear to right foot. Press into right leg and breathe in. Lift your side ribs away from right hip. Exhale, glide your left shoulder away from your ear. Press both feet to floor and then breathe in, lift belly, diaphragm, lift chest, and feel moving chest to chin. Exhale, relax your right ear to right shoulder. Inhale, feel this right from your lower back. So feel this and length the lower ribs away from sacrum. If you brought your left hand onto your glutes, so here, your left hand is onto glutes and then onto your sacrum and breathe. Press into your right foot and then lengthen. Use your left hand to traction your sacrum down and then lengthen out of lower back. And as you exhale, tuck, curl pubic bone to navel and send your sit bones back. Then you feel an opening into lower back. And then breathe in, draw chest to chin. Exhale, both shoulders away from your ears. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, release. Bring your hands to the floor for pitching. Set the right foot to the left edge of the mat. Your curl, the toes of your left foot are curled under, left knees off the floor. As you breathe in, moving belly away from pelvis. And exhale, folding forward over your right shin. If your back is tweaky, if your knees or hips are tweaky, sit on the right sit bone, tuck your right heel in and fold diagonally over your right shin. Deep breath, inhale. And exhale, everyone take it a little deeper. Deep breath, keep moving belly forward away from pelvis. And exhale. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, release. Hands are under the shoulders. Curl the toes under of your left foot. Step back into downward facing dog. Feeling for pushing floor away in downward dog. In downward dog, wrap the shoulders. Squeeze, feel as if you're closing your armpits. Triangle, breathe in. Step your left foot forward between the hands. 
your feet, they're about three feet away from each other, straight to your left leg. Some of you may want a, a block. So if you're using a block, have the block by your left foot. Arms are reaching out to side. Pressing into your left foot and then breathe in, reach. So keep feel this left. You're reaching your left arm forward. That left foot is straight. And then let your arm come down towards the floor as your right arm is reaching up. Try not to let your uh, right hip come forward so you use your hip back. to get this opening into hips and pelvis. That's a difficult reach for you. Your hand, left hand is onto a block. So the hand is onto a block, ankle, calf or floor. Right arm reaches the sky. Press into left leg and breathe in length and side ribs away from left hip. Exhale, glide your right hip back as you reach your right arm to sky. Breathe in and glide side ribs away from left hip. Exhale, tuck. Feels as you're tucking your left sit bone under, gliding your right hip back. So you feel and notice the triangles that you are creating with your toes. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, left arm is down, right arm is up. Place your right hand onto right hip. Now step your right foot forward a couple of inches. Bend your left knee and then breathe in, ease forward. Lift your right foot up and reach it back. You can have the block if you're using the block a little bit further and then push back into your right heel. You're going further, reaching your right arm up, half moon. And then breathe in, lift your side ribs away from left hip. Exhale, reach your right heel away from you, reach your right arm up. Now work today in trying to open your hips a little bit more. So you're not squared on, you're opening the hips and reach it back. Feel the opening into pelvis and reach back. Reach your right arm up. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, reach your heel away from you, reach your arms to sky. Vertical split. Bring your hands to the floor and then send your right leg straight out and up the sky. Walk your hands closer towards your left foot. Press your left foot to the floor and breathe in left and belly away from left hand. And exhale, push the floor away with your left foot as you reach your right leg straight up, reach it back. One more like this, breathe in and left the lower ribs away from waist. Exhale, reach your right leg back. Release hands to the floor. Step your right leg back. Step your left leg back for plank. Reach through your heels, feet together. Exhale, lower down, keep the elbows tucked in. Cobra or low cobra. Breathe in and move your chest and ribs forward. Lengthen your legs back. Shoulders relax. Exhale, lower down, hands under the shoulders, breathe in, toes under. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Wrap the shoulders in your downward dog, keep the neck relaxed. Triangle, breathe in, step your right foot forward between the hands. Your right foot is straight, if you need a block, the block is by your right foot. Arms are reaching out to side. Straighten your right leg. Press your left foot to floor, breathe in, reach your right arm forward, and then the arm is coming down, your left arm is reaching up. Your right hand is either on the floor, the ankle, the calf, or shin, or it's onto a block. So press into your right leg and breathe in, lift your side ribs away from right hip. Exhale, open chest, reach your left arm up, glide your left hip back. So if you're up against the wall, your sit bones are against the wall. That's what. That's the aim. So your right sit bone is up against the wall, reaching up. You're moving your left sit bone back as you reach out in this way. So it's not squared on. Opening into hips. Deep breaths. Inhale. And exhale. Feel for taking this a little deeper. Press your right foot to floor and breathe and glide your ribs away from right hip. Exhale, as you reach your right arm down, reach your left arm up, glide your left hip back. Half moon, place your left hand onto left hip. Bend your right knee. 
press your right foot to floor and breathe in ease forward and lift your left leg up and reach it straight back. So you can have that right hand on to block. Once you're ready to go further, you're reaching your left arm out and up to start. And then breathe in deeply. Keep lengthening out of lower back. Exhale, reach your left heel away from you. Reach your right arm up. Keep the neck relaxed. Deep breath, push the floor away with your right foot. And exhale, send your left heel back, flex the toes towards the shins. Breathe in and move belly forward away from pelvis. Exhale, tuck. So tuck tailbone, feels as if you're curling pubic bone to navel. Reach your left heel back, reach your left arm up. On the next breath, vertical sit. Bring your hands to the floor and reach your right leg straight out and up to scalp. As you breathe, lengthen belly away from your right thigh. Exhale, push the floor away with your right foot, reaching your left leg to sky. Walk your hands closer towards your standing foot. And then breathe in, traction belly away from right thigh. And exhale, reaching your left leg straight out and up to sky. Inhale, release. Bring your hands to the floor, step back. For plank. Reach for heels. Exhale, lower down. Inhale, cobra. Move chest and ribs forward, lengthen legs back. Exhale, press it back, downward facing dog. Feeling for pushing floor away in downward dog. On the next breath, worry two. Inhale, step your left foot forward between the hands. Right foot squares to the short edge of the mat. Your arms are reaching out to side. Bend that front knee. The front knee and ankle are aligned. Bring your left hand onto your left. Bring both hands onto your left thigh in actual fact. And we're traction your left thigh towards the left. So breathe and press down into both feet. Exhale, send your left thigh towards the left. Press the ankle press. Walk your right hand to the floor and then walk your hand towards your uh, right foot. Breathe into left hip. Exhale, send your left eye towards the left and bring your forehead to right. Breathe in and expand the ribs. Now exhale, send your left eye towards the left, bring forehead to right. Breathe in, balloon the breath into the left ribs. And exhale, send your left leg, left eye towards the left, bring forehead to right. Inhale, release. Turn your left foot forward. Slight stretch. Your left hand is coming across. It's taking hold of your uh, right shin. Right hand is either holding the shin or it's onto the floor. Breathing, glide ribs away from the left hip. Exhale, forehead towards your right shin. Deep breath, inhale. And exhale, forehead to right shin. For those who can, on the next breath, if you can, bring your right arm straight up. And exhale, roll chest open towards the right, right arm to the sky. That's difficult, right hand is onto sacral. Press your left foot to floor, breathe, and lengthen ribs away from left hip. Exhale, roll chest open, reaching your right arm up. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, release. Bring your hands down and step back for plank. Reaching back to heels, exhale, lower down. Cobra, inhale. Move your chest and reach forward, length the legs back. Exhale, press back, down, face the dog. Warrior two, breathe in, step your right foot forward between the hands. Your right heels align with the arc of the back foot. Bring both hands onto your right thigh. Warrior two with traction. Pressing into your right foot and then breathe in, lift belly away from thigh. Exhale, send your right thigh towards the right. Breathe in and keep lengthening, keep lengthening away from the top of right thigh. Exhale, send your right thigh towards the right. Head to ankle, prep. 
right hand stays on to right thigh, left arm either to the floor or walk it towards the foot. You can also have that hand onto a block and breathe in, breathe into right hip. Exhale, glide your right thigh towards the right, bring your forehead to the left and collect you. Balloon the breath into right side ribs. And exhale, feel for opening the right hip a little bit more. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, opening to the hips. Release, turn your right foot forward so both feet are facing forward. Bring your right hand around and takes hold of your left ankle or shin. Left hand is the floor or onto the ankle. As you breathe, glide ribs away from your right hip. Exhale, bring your forehead towards your left shin. Breathe in length and belly away from pelvis. Exhale, fold. Deep breath. Lengthen side ribs away from right hip. And fold and exhale, bend your right elbow. If you can, place your left hand onto sacrum. Roll the chest open to left. You're going further, reaching your left arm to stand. Half a beta. Now breathe in and glide. Ribs away from right hip. And exhale, rolling chest open. Reach your left arm straight up. Left foot presses to the floor and breathe, glide ribs away from left hip. Exhale, opening to the left a little more. Inhale, release. Bring your hands down under the shoulders. Step back for plank. Reaching through the heels. Exhale, lower down. Cobra, inhale, move chest, ribs forward, length the legs back. Exhale, press it back, downward facing dog. You're pushing floor away in downward facing dog. Twisting triangle. Breathe in, step your left foot forward between the hands. Arms are reaching out towards the side. Again, if you're uh, wanting to use a block, the block will be to the outside of your left foot. From here, your feet, they are about three feet away from each other. If this is really difficult in this pose, step your left foot about six inches to step the right foot six inches towards the right, but otherwise your heel and calf are, and, and arc of the foot are aligned. Breathe in, reach your left arm forward and then reach it down towards the floor. Reach your right arm up. And you can just reach it forward and then reach it all the way to the outside of your left foot. Then switch your left hand onto sacrum. If you're going further, reach your left arm out and up to the sky. Press into left leg and breathe, lengthen ribs away from left hip. And exhale, opening out towards the left. And you notice there that I move my right foot slightly towards the right and just helps to open the hips, open the lower back. Press your right foot to floor and breathe, lengthen ribs away from right hip. And then push the floor away with your left foot as you reach your left arm to start. Deep breath, feet gliding, side ribs away from left hip. And exhale, opening out to left. One more like this, deep breath. And then open, keep reaching that left arm up. Yeah, left arm up to sky. And then from there, from there, if you can, lift your right foot up and reach it straight back. That's it, yeah. You can place your left hand onto sacrum if that's a real, if that's really difficult. Use the blocks also, yeah, and reach back, reach back to heels. Good, nice. Deep breaths, just two more breaths, deep breaths. Keep moving, you're in, revolves half moon. Exhale. 
and release. Bring your hands to the floor for pigeon. So you're stepping your right leg back. Your left foot comes towards the uh, right edge of the mat. Pigeon twisting towards your foot. So ease your left foot up at a right angle. You have options here of taking hold of the foot and bringing chest to foot, sternum to ankle. Or if you're going further, your left elbow touch to the arc of your left foot, right hand is on top. Breathe in and lift your ribs away from your left hip. Exhale, either bringing sternum to foot, or if you're in the twist, twist away from the foot. Now breathe in, anchor, left sit bone to floor, and then stretch the ribs away from sacrum. And exhale, draw your chest closer to the foot, or twist away if you're in the twist. Taking two more breaths like this, deep breaths. And exhale, feeling for opening out a little bit more. One more breath in this, deep breaths. Good, and everyone release. Your hands are under the shoulders. Step back for plank. Reaching back to heels, exhale, lower down. Breathe into cobra. Move chest and reach forward, length and legs back. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. You push the floor away in downward facing dog. Twisting triangle. Inhale, step your right foot forward between the hands. Your right heel is aligned with the arc of the foot. You're reaching the arms out. From here, breathe in. Reach your right arm forward. The right hand comes to the floor. Reach your left arm back. And then press into your left foot. Breathe in. Lengthen your left arm forward. Bring your left arm down to the outside of your right foot. If you're wanting to use a block, the hand is onto a block. Right hand onto sacrum. Again, you might want to step your left foot slightly towards the left. Straighten your right leg. Breathe in, glide, ribs away from right hip. And exhale, reach your left arm down, roll the chest open towards the right. If you're going further, your right arm is reaching to sky. Press into left leg, breathe, and lengthen ribs away from left hip. Exhale, glide your right hip back as you reach your right arm up. One more like this, deep breath, move belly away from pelvis. Exhale, opening out towards the right. You're going further, place your right hand onto sacrum. If you're using a block, bring the block forward about one foot away from your right foot. And then ease forward. Lift your left foot up and reach it back, reach into the heel. You're going further, reaching your right arm up to the sky. Revolved half moon. Beautiful, beautiful shapes. Deep breaths, good. And then reach back, reach back to your left heel, everyone. Deep breaths, inhale. And then reach, reach back, good. Keep sending your right arm straight up to the sky. Deep breaths, that's it. And then open, keep opening to the right. Bend your knees slightly and then reach your Left leg back. One more breath, everyone. Good, and then release. Place the hands to the floor. Pigeon, sternum to ankle is your next pose. So the right foot is moving towards the left edge of your mat. Straight to the right leg, so the knee is good at the right angle. You're, you're taking hold of the arc of the foot. Straighten the left leg if you can. Breathe in, lift out, so hips away from your, ribs away from your hip, and exhale, sternum to ankle. You're going further, twisting, twisting pigeon, your elbow, right elbow touches the arc of the foot, your left hand is on top. Breathe in, glide, ribs away from your right hip, and exhale, twist to the right, twist to the left. 
and breathe deeply, keep lengthening out of lower back. And exhale, twist. Deep breath. And exhale, either bring the sternum closer to the ankle or twist away. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, release. Bring your hands down and step back to downward facing dog. Downward facing dog. Now everyone breathe in and spread the ribs. Exhale, reach your heels to floor, squeeze your elbows in so you're wrapping the shoulders. One more like this, deep breath. Exhale, lengthen through spine. From here, bend the knees and come all the way up and down. You will need your strap for this next pose. So grab hold of your strap. Sit down and reach your left foot forward. Bring your right foot on top of your left and draw the foot as close towards your thigh bone as you can or hip bone as you can. Coming into half lotus. Place the strap around your right ankle and then move it towards your right hip. Bring your uh, left hand around and take hold of the strap by your uh, right hip. Breathe in, reach your right arm up. And as you breathe out, bring your hand down to the outside of your left foot. Breathe in, lift your side ribs away from your uh, right hip. Exhale, exhale, glide your left shoulder back and away from your hip. Breathe in, lift belly, lift diaphragm, lift chest. Reach your left foot forward, glide your left shoulder back. Breathe in, lift belly away from pelvis. As you breathe out, glide your left shoulder back, right ear is by right shoulder. One more like this, deep breath. And exhale, release and change. Reach your right leg straight forward. Tuck your left foot in so the left foot is onto your right thigh. Strap is around your left ankle. Then bring it towards your left hip. Bring your right arm around, takes hold of the strap by your left hip. Breathe in, reach your left arm up. Exhale, bring it down to the outside of your right hip. Breathe in, lift out of your right side. Exhale, glide your left shoulder, right shoulder away from your hip. Breathe in, lift your side ribs away from your left hip. And exhale, glide your left shoulder away, right shoulder away from your hip. Breathe in, lift sternum. Exhale, glide your right shoulder back. Inhale, release. From here, coming into a spinal twist with both knees bent. So you'll just demonstrate your lie down onto your backs. Your arms are out to the side. Your knees are bent. You breathe into lower back, spread ribs to the floor. As you breathe out, draw the knees towards the chest and allow the knees to come as close towards your left armpit as you can. Bring your left hand down, either taking hold of the top of your thigh or by hip or onto the lower rib cage. Your head is in the opposite direction to these. So from here, everyone, you're breathing into lower back, spreading ribs. Exhale, relax your right shoulder away from your knee. Breathe in and lengthen belly away from pelvis. As you breathe out, allow your knees come to come closer towards the floor, closer towards left armpit, but don't force this. Breathe in, lengthen your side ribs away from uh, hip. 
And exhale, soften your right shoulder away from your ear. Breathe to sternum and filling your heart with breath. And exhale, release. Release both arms to the floor. Press your arms to the floor. And as you breathe in, draw your knees back to center. As you exhale, allow your knees to come down towards the right side, close towards the right armpit as you can. If your knees are not touching, don't, that's okay. If you have a block, you can place a block between your feet. This gives you a little bit more support. Left arm reaches out towards the left. Your right hand is onto your thighs, hip, or the side rib. Your head is in the opposite direction to me. Breathe in, lengthen belly away from pelvis. Exhale, relax your left shoulder away from your ear. Breathe to lower back and lengthen out of lower back. Exhale, relax your jaw. Breathe in, lengthen side ribs away from your left hip. And exhale, allow your body to let go a little bit more. Breathe to sternum, filling your heart up with breath. Exhale, let your shoulders relax. Press your arms to floor. And as you breathe in, ease your knees back to center. And exhale, release. Place your feet to the floor. And then stay here. You're lying down in your final pose, Shabasta. So either the soles of your feet together, uh, or so, sorry, soles of your feet to the floor, knees up, or soles of your feet together, knees out to side, or straighten your legs. Left and left away from you. Arms relaxed, shoulders are away from your ears. Lie down in your final pose, Shavasta. So giving yourself this time, this moment, just for you. If you can, close your eyes. And then make any adjustments. So lengthen, feel the lengthening through the body. Your buttocks presses to the floor and then move your belly and your lower ribs away from sacrum. And then just let go. Reach your heels away from you and then let go. So let your legs just as if they're flaring out towards the side. Let your shoulders relax away from your ears. Allow yourself just to be in this moment as you let go. As you lie here, feel the sensations, the many sensations that's bubbling around inside. And this helps to helps us to remind, this helps to remind us of the complexity of who we are. So right now in this moment, you're feeling many things. Some things are fairly obvious to you and some things are not. The conflicted nature 
of who we are. So give yourself time to allow yourself to just to explore, to understand. But knowing that things reveal themselves in their own time. Give yourself time to allow your body to open up and to allow those areas that are hidden to become more visible. Feeling those different sensations. So scan your body, notice how your body feels, notice what you feel and where you're feeling this. And then begin to move in a way that delights your body, in a way that delights your spirit. And feel for stretching out, breathing into what you feel. Allow your body to open up as you stretch. Once you've had a good, written, really nice stretch, bend the knees and move your knees towards your chest. Hug your knees close. And allow your body to move side to side, forward and back. And then roll to your left side. Bring your right hand to the floor by your chest. Breathe in, on exhale, push the floor away with your right hand as you come up and use your left hand to support your head in there. Sitting up tall, hands together, the thumbs are lightly touching the ground. Give yourself time and notice how you feel. And thank you for allowing me to guide. All that is good, all that is honorable in me salutes, all that is honorable, all that is good in you. Breathe in deeply. Namaste. Thanks, everyone.